So today we are, uh, we've introduced to the press our, uh, our partnership with the Paralympic teams of uh, Belgium and France. And uh, in particular, we are here at Temple Mills in the depot to uh, introduce the work we're doing on the train set to accommodate on board the Paralympic teams. And of course, the, the key issue was how do we get uh, up to 18 athletes in wheelchairs on our trains when there are only two positions for wheelchairs? We take out of two coaches the seats and uh, we put in place a number of uh, uh, additional features so that the wheelchair users can sit there. I think it's very good, especially because uh, when we travel to the Paralympic Games, I think it's important to travel as a whole team, as, as yeah, all the athletes can travel together and we have already the team spirit when we are leaving. To actually have that, that team spirit and that team morale and to be in one place as a team, it, it makes all the difference. For us athletes, it's important, no stress, not a um, long day to travel. I think it's very important that Eurostar is uh, the first train that uh, adapts um, their trains for wheelchair users and uh, hopefully in the future other companies will do this. The two teams will come uh, to London on the 25th and 26th of August and the two uh, delegations are up to 300 people. I'm very much looking forward to the, my second Paralympic Games. I'm happy that it's getting closer and I'm, I'm very excited to perform there. Going into London, we, we've got good expectations. Um, obviously being ranked number one last year. I want to go out there and, uh, and try my best. That's all I can do and hopefully my best will uh, be the right thing on the day. I'm so excited that I want to, the, the Paralympic Games will come tomorrow. And they will be all coming back to uh, Brussels and Paris on the 10th of September at the end of the, of the Paralympic Games. And certainly uh, a lot more relaxed uh, with more medals. And uh, I'm sure they will be uh, enjoying a glass of champagne on board.